All right, what's up everybody? Another day, another property tour. So today I'm here in Sun City, Summerlin. That's right, we are gonna be touring this a lovely single story home. Uh, this home right here was actually built in 1999, completely rehabbed. So today we are in this lovely community. As you can see, we have sidewalks on both sides. Now, the other thing I want you to take a look at is you also have mailboxes on every single house too as well versus like one designated area now this home is actually located on a golf course not too sure what hole it is however this hole I mean this hole <laughs> this home has been completely remodeled now let's see here and I'm trying to read my phone because I don't have the cheat sheet with me but um, home was built in 1999 this home features a single story, 2,934 square feet, three bedrooms, two baths. So let's take a look at this. This is a completely remodeled. As you can see, the stamped concrete has been resurfaced. The exterior of the home, completely refurbished and painted. A lot of mature landscaping. I'll give a quick shout out to uh, Drew Grossel at Platinum for allowing me to do this video tour. Now obviously this is a, a flip property. But they did a really good job and we've seen the exact same home like this a couple days ago on the channel. Pretty much exactly the same floor plan as you enter. You're greeted with this nice chandelier, modern chandelier. Oh, I just burped and double tree ceiling. Let me just take you straight back here. Take a look at this. Look how gorgeous this is. Love these windows. Beautiful mountain views. Summerlin now on the other one that they did the flips they put the mirrors on here which I thought was a great idea I would have loved to see that on this you have laminate flooring now if you guys want more information about this property I'm gonna have a link in the description below let's head on down here see what we got so we have one bedroom here just right off the entry kind of cool if you could put a door right here yeah that's what I would do check this out let me know in the comments below if this is something you would do check this out I would put an iron fence right here with a door entry door ring doorbell comes through take this out I'll put a door here reason why I would do that is so that way for my guests if they wanted just to come straight in without bothering you boom they could actually do that now I'm gonna have a link in the description and also in the comments too as well so that way you guys know exactly uh, what the dimensions are not bad all right let's come this way here down this hallway oh we got the bathroom forgot to turn on the light on this one so I do apologize half bath Surrounded by 24 by 48 inch on the tile. Nice schluters, silver. Then they got the mirror here with the towel hook. Okay, let's exit this thing. Orange peel texture. Coming down this hallway here. Now this takes you out to the kitchen, main living, and you have another hall, but before we get into the gravy, let's go look at this other stuff. Now also, if you guys haven't had a chance to subscribe to this channel, um, go ahead and click that subscribe button. So these are shakers, full dovetails, soft closing cabinets. Not bad. You got the white quartz. Right here's your three car garage. Now, price per square foot is about 426. You got gas dryer here your attic axis is right there and it looks like you got some shelving here Ooh, another door okay linen closet not bad six panel door now um, the HOAs on here 138 a month oh so this three-car garage 
Looks like they painted the concrete here. So this is a three car garage with a smart car or golf cart. You have four can lighting here, which is really nice. Be great to turn this into a storage. Love the fact that we have a furnace here, both furnaces. And it looks like we have a filter, a electronics filter here which is cool, that's a upgrade. Those are about 1500 bucks. Standard water heater that has been upgraded. You also have an access to your subfloor there, or into the truss. Oh, your soft water loop would be right here. They, they taken that out. What does that make my way around? Might as well just turn this off. So this uh, community has a gym, full facilities, right? Exercise room, fitness center, indoor outdoor pool, tennis courts. You figure when you get up on age, you would actually start to downsize, but it's not in this one. Missing a shower rod. One thing I would love to see on here is some lights right above here. Because you only got these uh, Wisconsin lights. We got 10 foot ceilings and a ceiling fan. Let's come out into the. Oh, uh, you know what? Let's go take a look at the master first. Yeah, let's do that or the primary. The primary is going to be 14 by 15. Like how they cladded this. Let's see if I can get a better angle with the uh, the light here. So these are LEDs, so basically you change the color on here. The ceilings on on this one, I believe they are 12 foot ceilings, very high on the ceilings, which is great. Now take a look at this bathroom here. As we come into the bathroom, 12 by 24 on the tile. Again, white shaker cabinets, black hardware, undermounted sinks, beautiful backsplash. Uh, this mirror is a little bit different. Oh, okay, so they changed this mirror up because this is where you're gonna sit down, which makes sense. First I walked in like, is this thing like crooked? Should have been turned the other way? Wow, I love this tub that they added. This is all new. And they did a great job. Look at this shower, completely redone. Nice faucet. Wow, look at this. Ooh, three quarter glass. I'm loving this. Love this. Beautiful pan, love the bench. And I love that window right there too. Great job, guys. And I love how they clad this all the way out this way. Really give that spa sensation. Here's your water closet. Oh, well, I'm already in here. Might as well just turn off the lights. Turn off the lights. Might as well turn off the lights. Ooh, I love how bright this closet is. Well, so you have an attic access here, but they did cover that with the chicken wire shelving. You're definitely going to need one of those hooks, you know, at the retail store to grab your clothes or your shirt. Now, let's go take a look at the kitchen here. But, I'm gonna make one more lap of this because this is just gorgeous. I mean, just sitting here and just like admiring the mountain views and the golf course. Property taxes on here is uh, uh, $5,430 annually. I like how they cladded the 
fireplace. That's the original fireplace. All the way to the top. Ceiling fan. I don't know if I mentioned orange peel texture. And take a look at this angle right here. If you are interested in this property, earnest money deposit on here is uh, $20,000. You put that down to tie this up into escrow. Then we went with the darker shaker cabinets on here. Love this uh, undermount basin sink here. Let's take a look at that. They did the 42 upper cabinets to get this more luxury. I would have did another 42 upper with a double stack. I would have took this all the way up to the top. Because the ceilings are so high. I do love this grill right here, this Thor. Same thing right here with the cabinets. I would have took this all the way up to the top. I love this window right here that brings in a lot of light and that's gorgeous if you want to see quality of work right attention to detail if you take a look underneath the toe kicks if they're clean that means these are things that um, they actually look out for so that just tells you that they're pretty good rehabbers attention to detail Now let's take a look at the lot size on here. This just literally hit the market, so this is gonna go pretty fast. Lot size is a 9,148 square feet. On their other uh, property, they had a deeper backyard. I'd get rid of this uh, fencing here. Take a look at this. You got the side axis here. I didn't like this golf course before, but I thought it was kind of short and boring, but I actually could like this golf course now. I think I'm going to go this week. Let me know if you guys want to um, play golf with me and hang out. Be nice to hang out with a couple uh, fans of the show. Haven't done that for a while. Say what's up, YouTube. <laughs> All right, let's go back inside now. All right, guys, let me know what your thoughts are about this property. If you can see yourself living here. Because I definitely can. Other than that, uh, like I said, I'll have the link in the description below. And also, if you guys haven't had a chance to subscribe to this channel, subscribe to this channel. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Other than that, I do appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart. I'm Chuck it's with Simply Vegas. Be blessed, folks. Did you like that video home tour? Are you a fan of this channel and you want to get plugged into the real estate market? Well, I got something for you. We have a new channel, real estate, vlogs, Las Vegas lifestyle, behind the scene, financing, flipping, commercial properties, interviews, local businesses, Chuck It's Cruise 2.0. Check it out.